we begin, it's dark and we are preparing for the students and by the time they've left, it's daylight. It's a symbol of all of us in the darkness and once we know Jesus, we've come into the light. When I was in high school, a family in our neighborhood invited students over for pancakes um, before school. And it made an impression on me and made me feel um, that somebody else cared beyond my family. And somebody saw me and I was welcomed and invited anytime. The Lord just put on my heart, it's your turn to do something like that. We talked about it and I wanted to pursue how do we go about serving the population at Arlington High. And we were sitting at a baseball game um, with Coach Peach and his son and our son were playing. I looked at him and said, Coach, I'd like to minister to the students of Arlington High. She said, what do you think about me inviting some of the boys over to our house, maybe once a week, to feed pancakes to some of our football boys? And I said, Julie, God has had it on my heart for quite a while now uh, to do something with Christian Ministries um, under the guise of FCA on our campus. What if we did the pancake breakfast here at Arlington High? And she said, you're kidding me, that would be incredible. As I was going through my cancer journey, I had been reading Hagar's story in Genesis. I loved her name of Elroy, saying, you are the God that sees me. And Elroy Family Pancake Breakfast was born. Every other Wednesday is prep day for Elroy. I am usually making eight to 10 gallons of batter. I head up to Arlington High and meet one of our volunteers and we set up some tables and get the skillets lined up so that we're ready to get going. Craig shows up a little bit before I do it. About six o'clock in the morning. I start doing the sausage first or bacon. I have done sausage and bacon. We're making pancakes upstairs. When they walk up the stairs, they're greeted with pancakes ready to go. Water and Sunny Delight ready. Fresh fruit is ready. Greeting them with a smile. And lots of syrup. <laughs> Lots of syrup. I like the idea of getting a message every other week and that thought that there's other people here that are also walking the same path that I am. I feel like it's made me want to get closer to God, learn more about Him. I love the community part of it and how watching kids from all over Arlington High School, different athletes from every sport come in, be in community with each other, learn about Jesus from a very real perspective. When we wrap up and students are leaving with a full stomach and ready to face their day, our goal is that they leave feeling full of truth and hope and that they have felt seen, not just by the volunteers, not by the people that are preparing for them, but that they feel seen by God who loves them and that we are just the conduit. We're just the ones that said yes. <laughs>